Hello and welcome to today's lesson. Today we're going to explore more on the single note lines on minor chords, dominant chords and we'll probably take a brief look at the major chords also. We're going to look at our scale choices uh, and how we view uh, each of the voicings on the particular chord on the fretboard. Uh, so before we get started let's once again tune up. I'll give you my low E. A string our fourth D our third string G our second B And finally, our high E. Okay, the first chord we're going to look at is we're going to look at how to, to solo and build our solos on a minor chord. Now, a lot of the previous work that you've done on major harmony, we've done the chords in the key of G major, the one, the two chord, three, four, or five chord, our 6 chord, and our 7 chord, and the 1. We're going to extract the 2 chord, which would be A minor. And to build on our solos, instead of thinking totally scale, we're going to look at building it from the arpeggio, and then gradually adding the, the other notes to it, which is a good structure, a good foundation, for whether you're playing on minor chords, uh, dominant chords or major chords. So the first thing we want to get in place is the minor seventh arpeggio. Now if you follow me on this we'll play the root note, the minor third, the fifth and the flat seventh. That's the four notes that make up that sound, the A minor seventh chord. We'll play it now on both octaves to take over the root minor third, fifth, flat seven, the root, minor third, fifth, flat seven, and the root. And we'll include the low flat seventh there and back home to the root. So what I would urge you to do is to become really familiar really familiar with those notes. We're playing over the G form of the A minor 7th chord, so have that as a visual reference that you can both hear and see visual reference and also listen to the quality of the notes against that chord. Later we'll take it through the other, the other forms, but meanwhile we'll just get really familiar. when soloing a lot of just not just the notes playing straight we can add rhythm we can change dramatically the sound by adding dynamics and rhythm and we'll look at our phrasing later on <laughs> 